welcome back fierce fitness and health family and if you are just joining us today we have a health talk and we're focusing on natural remedies today and we will be focusing on one particular herb called rosemary i guess you've heard about rosemary you've seen the plant or if you've not that's what you see on your screen right now. So join the channel, subscribe, and drop a comment below. Let me know which plants you have in mind to plant in your garden, but you do not know all the health benefits or what you can get from that particular plant. And we will share those with you on this channel because health is wealth, and that is what we focus. We give you health talks, and we do workout videos, exercises at home, at the gym, everything that concerns health and wellness, that's what we discuss on this channel. So feel free free to subscribe and uh, turn on notification bell that being said also share with friends of yours share with family members okay so we will be discussing rosemary plant and all the health benefits so if this plant you don't have it in your garden please i am encouraging you today to please go plant it because i know most time people focus on plants that will give colorfulness to their gardens or their environment their houses their yard wherever you have your garden or whatnot or the small space you have in your yard but sometimes we have to also include not just flowers but let's also learn how to include herbs that are healthy and uh, we can actually use them for skincare uh, overall health we can use them for hair growth and more and rosemary is one of those plants and if you're talking about beautifying your garden also rosemary is beautiful plant that is green and it produces purple colored flowers so that's also going to add beauty to your garden so you need not worry so let's dive right into the video right about now i have been yapping for a little bit right about now so i'm just going to give you some of the health benefit i don't want to go into deep i don't want to bore you but i want to give you i want to tell you what you are here to listen to what you're here to hear as you clicked on this video so rosemary plant is good for liver detoxification okay so when you want to do your detoxification if you have the rosemary plant in your garden it is a good one it is going to help you and the rosemary plant is one plant that you can use fresh or dry okay you can dry it or you can use it fresh but if you don't have it in your garden do not worry also because there are shops that sells uh these plants and you can actually go get rosemary from the shop okay already processed and ready to use okay so the deto detoxification of the liver rosemary is good uh, and it's going to help you with that is also good with respiratory health okay so it's going to help your respiratory system very well um rosemary plants also have uh deuteritic uh, properties and it's going to help you with that it also going to help with freshness of breath you don't have to worry about you're talking to someone and your breath is like oh my goodness <laughs> so yes it helps to freshen the breath and rosemary plant also helps to improve uh blood circulation and one of the most popular thing that everybody talks about like that's almost the number one thing that people would mention when it comes to rosemary plants is the hair growth rosemary plant is good in hair growth either you just harvesting it as uh when it's fresh right from the tree and boiling it now if you want us to we can do a separate video about the hair growth but i just on this particular video i just want to tell you some of the health benefits and what you should expect if you're using rosemary in your cooking health skincare uh drinking it as a tea or whatnot so yes hair growth that is one so if you're suffering from hair loss or you just want to grow your hair you want a healthy beautiful hair then think about rosemary plant also rosemary plant is also good in um, digestion so it will help your digestive health digestive system now uh, rosemary plant is also antibacterial which is awesome so you using it you know that you're not going to be worried about bacteria and stuff like that and also rosemary plant is an immune booster okay so all right so let's continue like i said it's a good immune booster rosemary plant and it's also anti-inflammatory so when you're battling all this inflammation and whatnot think about rosemary plant it is also good in relieving pain so it's pain relief plant it's also good for migraine headache you know it relieves migraines if you suffer from migraine headache and stuff like that it also elevates your mood 
Okay, so when you're in this type of mood that you don't understand, think about your rosemary plant. It also improves memory. Okay, sometimes people battle with memory issues. Think about memory plant. And it may also help with cancer prevention. So it's better for you to start taking it other than waiting until you've been diagnosed with cancer, then you start battling it. Better to keep your health in a good place so you don't worry about illnesses like cancer and more. Let's see more health benefits of rosemary mary plant also one of the health benefits you should be expecting is that it will help to combat fungal skin problems so if you're suffering from that it is going to help you with that it not you know it nourishes your hair it combats dandruff and supports healthy hair growth okay it helps to clear the respiratory tract it helps it helps you with uh breathing easily and it will also help you with allergies it's good during the cold season there is so many health benefits okay uh, rosemary plant is also antioxidant it promotes uh, um, tight skin it gives you youthfulness you look youthful and it also helps you glow and radiate okay it suits your stress it calms you it's good for anxiety it helps to uplift your mood uh, through aromatic therapy so there is so much let us get right into more and let me know in the comment section which of these things you're hearing for the first time all right so the rosemary plant also have anti-aging properties it is antibacterial it is antidepressant it is anti-inflammatory it is antiseptic is antiviral it helps with cancer prevention okay it helps to facilitate digestion fatigue fighter so it's good with fatigue hair growth helps with migraine it improve, improves uh, blood flow i'm trying to pack as much as much as much information as i can on this one video rosemary plant will also help to improve your memory it helps to improve improve your immune system so it actually boosts your immune system it is good for kidney health is it also helps with a mood and hand like it enhances your mood i know if i mentioned that before it's uh okay it's also good okay it's called actually a natural mouthwash let me just put it that way it helps you with freshness of breath it keeps your mouth fresh so if you don't want to purchase all those over-the-counter mouth washes yes you can make one with your rosemary plant it's a natural pain killer so it helps with pain if you don't want to take uh, medicine you want to go the natural ways think about your rosemary plant is also good with your respiratory health it relieves menstrual cramp a lot of women battle with menstrual cramp so rosemary is also one of those uh plants or one of those herbs that you have out there that you might have in your garden or something you have in your kitchen that you can reach out for as a woman when you're suffering from menstrual cramp we all know how terrible that pain can be and a lot of people don't want to take medication don't want to get addicted to all this medication where you have to go take medication medication and some people's pain are so severe that even these medications don't help so sometimes all you need is stuff like ginger lemon warm water uh rosemary and many other uh herbs that you have in your kitchen in your garden you can go to the store and purchase and just make a tea out of or a warm press and just use it and it's going to help you now let me know in the comment section which other herbs are you thinking which other plants are you thinking of planting in your garden where you do not know the health benefits and you feel like i really don't want this if i don't know what i'm going to benefit from it if it doesn't look that beautiful because some of these plants might not look so beautiful but what you're going to benefit from them is the health benefits is just too numerous to be mentioned we cannot mention all of it in one videos researches are still going on on several plants trying to discover what uh we can what these plants can do for your health so also let me know in the comment section what plants do you have next in mind and i talked about rosemary being good for hair growth so if you're battling with hair loss or even if you're not battling with hair loss but you just want to grow a healthy uh hair then let me know if you want us to do a separate video where we can talk about the different processes, uh, the different ways you can actually process the rosemary plant in order to use it for just your hair growth. And we also have, we can also do a separate video for skincare, how you can use rosemary for skincare. 
so let me know in the comment section so far thank you very much for listening drop a comment and i so much appreciate god bless you see you all on the next video when we have our next health talk and that's it